So in this video, I'm going to show you how to use a micro bit to power a servo motor. So a servo motor is a motor that unlike a regular, a regular motor just turns around and around continuously unless you want to tell it to stop or change direction. A servo motor turns a precise distance. So we have it here in front of you. You'll see that it'll just turn. You'd use it for something like a robotic arm that can turn, say, at 90 degrees and then back up like that. So first thing you do is you open up your make code editor and then you go into your functions and we'll say on start. So when the thing starts up, we're going to have a, it's just going to show the number one. So this is just going to tell us that the thing is on and it's working and everything's connected. Then the next thing we're going to do is connect up our servo with our micro bit. So if you look at it here, you're going to put, this is going to go on zero. Now it could go to any of them and you could change that throughout your programming. But for the moment, we'll stick this with zero. Then you have your other two and they will go into ground and then your plus voltage. So it says plus three volts on that. And so these two are supplying power and this is telling the servo, sorry, these two are supplying power and this is telling the servo how much to move. So what you do is you set up your thing here and then you go to your inputs and we'll just do something very simple that's just gonna turn it in two directions. So when button A is pressed, we're gonna go down to our advanced functions and you'll see in advanced functions that you have servo, a servo box here. So you go down to servo right pin P0 to 180. So you can see we'd connected it to P0, so we'll leave it there. So you could connect a second servo, say to P1 if you want it. So we'll leave that at 180 degrees. Control and C to copy that. Then we can click Control and then B paste so we're going to use the same commands we're going to click change that to button b and then we're going to change our servo to the other extreme so we're going to put that to zero degrees so for these servos they're going to generally be working from one zero to 180 flipping over like that so that's the whole program and then we're just going to download click your download button right click show and folder and actually just one other thing to mention here when you're using a servo motor because you need an extra bit of power you need to make sure that this battery pack is plugged into the back so you need to make sure that cable's in when you're finished with these micro bits plug that out because it conserves battery life on them and um, so we've got it all up here take it drag it over into your micro bit When it downloads, you'll see that I've got one displayed there showing that it's working. There's my micro bit. So we'll try and test it out here in this. So I press B, it switches around to that direction and I press A and it turns back. So B forward, A back. And you can also test it out if you if it's not working on your micro bit, you can test out your program just to see that this is working here. So you just go to this. So you can see that you're testing out A is gonna move one direction, B moves it in the other direction.